I'm Antonio Centeno, the founder of Real Men Real Style. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to tie a scarf. And we're going to be talking in particular about the ascot and the once around ascot knot. Okay, if you haven't already, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. By doing that, these videos will come right to you. In addition, if you like this, if you find it useful, I would appreciate it if you would like it down below. And while you're down there, make sure to grab our free 47 page ebook on men's style. All right, so the ascot. It sounds fancier and probably harder than what it is. It's a very simple knot in which you can start with a, at least, you know, a medium length. You need to have a medium length scar scarf for this, uh, something that's at least 50 inches in length. This one is 60 inches, so plenty of room here. And the thing with the Ascot is you should have a little bit of a bulkier scarf, something with a bit of feel. You don't want to be using a silk scarf necessarily for this. It's going to look a little bit too feminine. And you come over, you go under, and you come up under here. So very simple, and you might, you're probably going to want to adjust this a bit. You can wear it under the overcoat. So go ahead and open up your overcoat and slip it right in there. I like a looser knot, and I like a knot that is also, for me, function is always paramount. So I want to bring it up. Let's see if I can. Yep. Bring that up like that. Perfect. Okay. Simply, that is the ascot. Let me show you one more time in case I lost anybody. Got one third of the scarf right over here, two thirds of the scarf over here. I'm going to come over, go under, come up. So, very simple. Okay, now let's talk about the double ascots or the wraparound ascot. Basically, it's a little, one more thing we're going to add to it. We're going to go around the neck first. But to do that, we're going to need a longer scarf. So that is key. The uh, double ascot is mostly, you've got to have a scarf that's around 72 inches in length. Depends on your build, but I need one that's around 72 inches. So we're going to start with about a quarter over here, three quarters over here. We're going to go once around. So if you've seen my once around tutorial, that's probably pretty familiar. And then we're going to do the same exact knot. Well, a little bit probably too much of a contrast there, but this is a double sided scarf with a gray and a navy on one color. Uh, I would probably adjust this a bit. But uh, you can see what I like this knot because it does a great job with the wraparound of covering the neck. In addition, you get a little bit of a knot here that adds a little bit of flair to the dress. But at the same time, we're focusing on function first and then the look second. So go with a wide variety of colors, depends on. I think this knot works really well if you've got a longer, a longer scarf with a little bit of color in it. Uh, and if you want to wear a silk scarf, you can do that as well. So again, we're going to do the wrap around and then go under. So you clearly need to be a little bit uh, to wear a silk scarf like this. It almost looks like an ascot, which Makes sense because it's tied with the ascot knot, but it, with this type of look, we're going less for uh, less for warmth. As you can see, there's even exposed some of my shirt here, and more for introducing the color. You don't want this too tight. Loosen and adjust it. All right, that is the ascot knot and the wraparound ascot or the double ascot. If you have any questions, I will see you in the comments. Otherwise, make sure to check out my other videos. We've got quite a few out there, and I wish you the best, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.